Discovering the history of a musical composition and of the composer is an important part of learning a piece of music. Since you are already sitting in front of a computer, use an internet search engine to find out when and where the composer lived and when he or she wrote the piece you are practicing. You will discover fascinating facts about the reasons why he wrote this work, what frame of mind he was in, who his friends were, all the way to negotiations with his publisher and his landlord. Understanding the life of a composer is an important way to gather insight into his personality. I will give you one example. Take the full orchestra score of a Mozart violin concerto and copy the first page by hand onto a sheet of music manuscript paper. Figure out how long that takes and then calculate how much time you would need to write the entire work. Now, try to do this with a quill pen made of a feather. And now, turn the lights out, write by candlelight, and turn the heat down. You have successfully recreated Mozart's working conditions. If you consider all the operas, symphonies, concerti, and sonatas he wrote in a very short life under very difficult circumstances, you discover that he must have been absolutely driven to write down all of the beautiful music that he constantly created in his mind. For the first time in history, you have the luxury to find all this out from the chair you are sitting in right now. Have the internet search be your first step in this discovery. Once you know what you're looking for, you can use libraries, listen to concerts and recordings, and talk with knowledgeable people about your music.